Uh, it's a very short thing. Uh, very unusual to... It's not unusual to... Place a microphone anywhere. Da 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 da. It's not unusual to experiment. Da 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 da. And so, um, it's been on my mind. Though, the even these surface areas here, here, um, even partly up there on that JBL, on the edge and there, yeah, there, uh, even the edges on the seats. Um, where high frequencies are coming from the screen channels. Um, you know, the, the way they locate a bit high. I want them down a little bit lower. Anyway, I'll still make it work, but it's sounds that are, you know, um, that's why I put some absorbent material on the back of the, uh, back of these JBLs because I knew that the sound is going to reflect onto the parallel onto the bare surface um, those sound will still be reflecting onto it you know uh, even if it, even if it's in an auditorium and the, the angle on the HF horns is that that uh, so they they're designed by a computer a blah blah black sheep and uh, and so where they're placed in the auditorium and their angle position and their directivity, the off axis, the on axis, all the axes, you know, all those things. Hey, don't worry about it. All right. <laughs> Basically, so the horn is so if it's angled at a certain angle, it will minimize the reflections onto the ceiling, uh, ceiling area and um, uh, some parts of the floor. Well, <laughs> obvious place a microphone around the room it picks up on those frequencies you know <laughs> um so I, I was kind of curious thinking i wonder if it's reflecting onto that you know on there i mean i could have put the microphone against there um and use this the same sort of absorbent material of uh using this material because I, I tested this with high frequencies because it's in sight line a line sight since line sight, uh, of course, that that reduced high frequency by about six dB. Um, still haven't finished all the others, <laughs> uh, but then, you know, if I was to put a microphone uh, very carefully, go round the edge closely uh, on the fabric here, and then come up to here, I should see a, a slight difference in the frequency rise, um, as well as armrests um but yeah it's just observing um even sound can slightly go in between there on the angle of the hf horns depending on which horn it could slightly slip in between this narrow gap here and then reflect onto that armrest there on that um, drink drink holder thing um, though I don't usually keep this seat up It'll usually be down in that position but yep yeah, it will reflect onto that uh, so I'll move the camera around uh, yeah, no, it's a bit difficult it's probably be easy down this way as high as I can go um, the angle but it yeah it does kind of miss it almost uh, the HF horns it, it does kind of miss it but you know, I need to go a little bit higher up but I can't, I can't I'm not on the step ladder but there um, if you have a camera and such and you move it around and such and then you'd be able to see like you know I know all that bundle there that's going to be reflecting changing different wavelengths of the high frequencies it's going to reflect on there regardless from from over that side it's going to reflect onto there regardless even even those speakers there the off, off axis sound are going to reflect over this way and screen channels well um, obviously they're, they're, within, they're within off axis sight line um, going to reflect on there
hey, embrace the reflection. That's all I can say. <laughs> embrace the reflection. <laughs> hey, it's even going to reflect onto a microphone, you know, so if you put a microphone near to a speaker, pretty near, some of the sound is going to reflect onto the onto that surface area of the top of the microphone and, you know, on certain, yeah. Embrace, embrace it. Don't sweat it, all right? <laughs> Um, at least I know uh, what I'm, 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 um, I'm aware of certain things, and I know there's certain, certain things that are going on in, within the room that are happening at a certain point, and I'm thinking, ah, oh, okay, how can I, how can I solve that? You know, because it's usually somewhere, sometimes associated maybe with the center channel and the right channel, or it could be the right center. And so, you know, think, okay, sound coming down around here off axis and it's probably reflecting and then causing a, a difference in the wavelength time delay um, <clears throat> you know um, yeah, it could be reflecting onto the I uh, can't do I can't put absorbent on the radiator but yeah it's in sight line uh, at least uh, the left left channel it's a pretty good sight line there and they could do some strange things on the frequency. Um, it's all sorts of things, but you know, hey, it's only frequency. It's only a movie. It's only music. We're only listening to it. 